What's up, guys? I'm here with Elizabeth Wagmeister. She's covering TV for Variety. A lot of TV news here at Comic-Con this year. What are the highlights so far? The highlight is Game of Thrones. They're in Hall H, so you know that all the fans are there. Thousands of them were waiting all night, waiting to get in. Who's going to miss Kit the most, since he's obviously dead? Kit who? <laughs> <laughs> we couldn't wait for him to be gone, to yeah. be honest. Yeah. Um, other big news, Fear the Walking Dead, which is the Walking Dead spin-off. They had their first Comic-Con. They announced the premiere date. It's August 23rd, so fans getting super excited for that. When civilization ends, it ends fast. CBS also has a huge presence, and word on the street is Bradley Cooper made an appearance for his show Limitless. Yes, yeah, so I would be lying if I told you Bradley Cooper was here, but he kind of was. He surprised the room from London. He actually shot a video from his iPhone himself, which is kind of cool, and he's an executive producer on Limitless. It's a show that is a takeoff from the movie, so it actually starts right where the movie ended, and he's not only an EP on it, he actually makes a cameo appearance in the pilot and maybe more throughout the series. It's about time you and me talked. I think it's going to be a hit for CBS. I know it's outside the TV realm, but Halle Berry, I know she said, if you guys want me to have a full storm film, let people know. Yes, I was in that room for that panel, and it was the last question because the panel was for her CBS show extent, but uh, of course they asked if Halle Berry would do a storm standalone movie because Wolverine's had so much success and the X-Men franchise is so big, and she said, absolutely, I would love to, and she told the fans to call Fox, so we'll see. Okay, and then Big Bang Theory, there was some rumors about some coitus. Leonard, as soon as we get home, I want to have coitus with Amy. So of course the Big Bang Theory fans, they want Amy and Sheldon to, you know, have some more, uh, some more, some more sex scenes, we'll say. And there was actually a big surprise that Maya Bialik came out, and she actually read fan fiction about her character and Sheldon's getting together. That's like breaking the internet right there. And it was really cool to see Chuck Lorre and his team watch her read it. They were cracking up. The room was very happy with it. And then Steve Malaro, one of the EPs, he promised the room that you'll find out more about Sheldon and Amy in the first episode of season nine, which premieres in September. All right, guys, that's it for us. Follow at Hollywood on Twitter and Facebook.